Welcome to Civil War Camp. While we can't be with you in person here at camp, we wanted to provide you with some experiences that you could have at home doing some similar things. For those of you that have been here before, what's happening behind me looks very similar. As with new, new recruits during the Civil War, um, our soldiers start by learning how to be a soldier. Uh, we primarily use Hardee's drill manual, um, which was one of the more common uh, manuals that was used at the time. So, for a new, new recruit, they would start off uh, with an instructor. That instructor ideally would teach one person or a small group of soldiers how, how to stand, how to march, how to use their weapon. Um, so that, that's what we're going to start off with. We hope you'll join us and, and have fun. Okay, so welcome to your initial training. First thing we want to go over today is, is just basing movements and getting you to be able to move in from one position to another position. So the first thing I'm going to start with is, is basing movements. And I'm going to start with left base. So I want to turn to this direction. You guys are just not dressed. Not, you're not going you know, to do this. I'm going to demonstrate first. So left base, I'm going to pivot on my left heel. So left base. about face at rest. I realized I didn't demonstrate that, so I'm going to demonstrate that one to you first. On about face, you're going to carry your foot back here on about, and at base, you're going to pivot on the left heel all the way around to be 180 degrees. About face. Got it? Attention. Right, face. Right, face. About face. Face. Left face. In 
place. Rest. Good. I think you guys are ready to get some right. All right. So welcome back. We're going to be carrying on at, uh, the instruction today with rifles. And the, the first thing I want to go over is the position of attention. I'm going to demonstrate and then I'll call you guys to attention. So a position of attention, the heels are together. The, the toe of the stock is with my toe. The rifle is, is coming up to the side, right up to my right armpit. And, and my hand is, is grasping between the two bands and a V shape. And my left hand is on the seam of my trousers on the other side. My chin is up, my eyes are forward. And I'm waiting for directions. All right. Attention. Good. In place, rest. The next thing we're going to go over is, is the facing movements. From, from the position of attention, if you're at the order, you're just going to lift the rifle up. So I'm going to do it from the, from the order, and then we will do it from the shoulder after I teach that. So reviewing the facing movements, left face, I'm going to face this way 90 degrees, I'm going to pivot on the left heel. So left face, left face, and I'm going to do about face now, about face, in place rest. So here I am, I'm getting ready to go to do the facing movements. Attention. Left face. Left face. About face. In place, rest. So this is the position of at the order. The position we want to go to is most of the time when we're moving is going to be at the shoulder. At the shoulder is on the right shoulder, but what we're going to do is go to sh shoulder, arms, carry the rifle up, grasp the rifle, move the index finger and little finger on the, on the trigger guard and the hammer, and it's going to be held tightly into my armpit, and then you're going to carry your left arm back down to the seat. This is a position of shoulder arms. So I'm going to go back to order arms. The command would be order arms. I let it come back down, and then I cut back to my out seam of my trousers. So attention. Shoulder arms. Order arms. Press. The next thing we want to do is, is we're going to go to right shoulder shift. Right shoulder shift is going to be carrying the rifle up on our right shoulder. The lock plate is going to be facing forward. This is a position we're going to be in when we're marching or when we're moving at, at a quick pace. If we're doing something on the field, we automatically go to right shoulder shift. When we go to company in the line, and one come online you go back to the shoulder okay so attention no, I'm just demonstrating at this point shoulder arms is here order arms is here right shoulder shift carry it up your hand is on the on the button the stock the lock plate is carried all the way up into on my shoulder and then go back to the shoulder Shoulder, arms, extend your arm, carry it back down. Order, arm, is back to you. So attention. Order, I'm sorry, shoulder, arms. Order, arms. Right shoulder shift, arms. Order, arms.
shoulder, arm. Right shoulder, shift, arms. Raise the lock plate up. There you go. Shoulder, arms. Order, arms. And place rest. The next command I want to go over is support arms. Support arms is going to be on the left arm, or left shoulder. The left shoulder, this position is very comfortable when you're standing sentry deal, detail. It's more comfortable when that right shoulder shift is. And your arm gets to rest. So support arms, it's gonna come up. Your hand's gonna go to the small of the stock. You're gonna drive it up into the shoulder. And then your, right, your left arm's gonna come over and you lower the hammer into the, to the forearm. And then you cut away hand returns to your top seat, your trousers. This position is support arms, and it's very comfortable. Rest is your hand comes up here to hold it, and you can take some of the pressure off your arm if you feel it. The tension is back on. So to go to the shoulder, you'd bring your hand up to the small of the stock, hands on the out of the side of the rifle, and you carry it over to the shoulder. Order, lower it down to the order. Tension. Support arms. Shoulder arms. Order, arms. In place, rest. If it's raining and inclement, we want to protect our rifle. We won't, don't want water going down our barrel and our lock plate getting wet. We're going to go to a position that's called secure arms. So I'm going to demonstrate that and then I'll have you guys do it. It's almost very similar to coming to support arms, except you're going to pivot the rifle down. So attention, I'm going to be here going up to, like I'm going to uh, support arms. So it's going to be secure arms. I'm going to bring the rifle up, spin it, bring it to here, and then pivot it down. Lock plate is under my arm, and my thumb is pinning the ramrod so it doesn't fall out. This way the rain runs down, the lock plate's protected, the barrel's protected. To, to come out of this, you're going to go to the shoulder, you'll bring it back up, taking care not to hit your biomate in front, and then you're going to carry it across your body to the shoulder. Attention. Secure arms. Good. Shoulder arms. Order arms. In place, rest. we're going to demonstrate is, is a load nine times. Load nine times is the way that we, we uh, will load the musket to fire in training. So load nine times, load. The rifle's going to be carried in front of me. My hand's going to go to the cartridge box. Handle cartridge. I'm going to grab the cartridge, carry it up to my teeth, and be ready to tear it. And then it's tear cartridge. Tear the cartridge carry the cartridge to the front of the barrel in a position to, to uh, pour in the black powder and the mini ball. So charge cartridge. You're going to pour the powder, push the mini ball down, and your hand's going to come to your ramrod. And then draw rammer. One, two, 
ram cartridge. You're gonna ram the cartridge down in. You're gonna pack it down and then return rammer. One, two, At this point, we're ready to prime. The order is going to be given prime. You're going to carry the rifle up, muzzles at eye level, lock plate is over your cap box. I go to the half cock, take the old cap off, reach into the cap box, grab my, my cap, put it on the cone, and I will come to the shoulder. I am in a position where my officer knows I'm loaded and I'm ready to fire. The commands to fire are ready. I will come to the T cap box or cart the lock plates right above the cap box. Come to the full cock. Now I'm ready. Aim and then fire. And then the next command you're going to hear is recover arms back to the ready, and then shoulder, arms. We're done. The next evolution is load nine times. Load nine times, load. Handle cartridge. Clear cartridge. Charge cartridge. Attention, shoulder, arms, load in nine times, load, handle, cartridge, tear, cartridge, charge, cartridge. Draw grammar. Ram cartridge. Return grammar. Prime. Ready. Aim. Fire. Recover arms. Shoulder arms. Load. to the shoulder when ready. Ready. Aim. Fire. Recover arms.
shoulder, arms. Present, arms. Shoulder, arms. Quarter, arms. 